All right, let's move to new business, life safety. What is this? This is your first read. This is the formal report. We broke it up because it is so large. Uh, again, I would refer the board to when you have time to review this, as well as that summary that Carrie provided <coughs> earlier in the packet. You'll get a copy of that binder. Um, it's, it's going to be confusing for you to read at first. There's stuff that seems repetitive. Some's labeled A, some's labeled B, but it looks like it's dealing with the same facility or same area. Um, it, it's a, it's, this is the formality of having the board see it as a first read. And then after we do that public committee meeting where the board can have more time to dig into this, uh, we'll eventually approve this either in November or the first board meeting in December, or the only board meeting in December. And then you want to make sure that Mary Ann's just to let the board members know and can re reaffirm that again. You're going to go out and sur survey when the board members get a common date. Yeah, she's trying yeah. to defer the process we're <coughs> using is we're starting with Kerry, getting three dates from Kerry, then okay. we're bouncing those off of John and Tim as the co chairs. Okay. And then from there, we're keeping it on an evening night, 6 30, 7 o'clock. We're trying to focus on a Monday or Tuesday so it's similar to a board meeting. And then if the board can make it, they can make it. Okay. So there's there's two documents here, right? The yeah. document starting on page 108 is different than the document starting on page 112. 108. 108 112. You, you lead that. You lead into my question. I think it's just more of our summary. Why would why did we send the stadium thing to the, to the state facilities? We didn't. Nothing's, Nothing's been sent, been sent yet. Okay, so why is there this letter presented? You have to present have to the letter. The, the stadium, yeah. that's a format the stadium is going to require outside of the life safety. What she's going to show in that life safety report that it will cost, the repair, repair and replacement cost will be near similar, that it will cost almost the identical to replace the facility as it would to repair it to address all the life safety. So she has to write the specific letter because that's a facility we're looking to repair, replace in, instead of repair. So she has to itemize that out and grab the attention of the state, the, the approver at the state. Then throughout the life safety report, she also has to document it in okay, the So this safety. would go out upon our approval, our approval of the plan. Yeah. So yes. this yeah. doesn't go anywhere until, because I, no, I saw a date on it. No, 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 it's just a draft to show you no, what she has to say. No problem. Yeah, no, sure. it's not Nothing's been sent. Thank you. Okay, uh, so I'll look at that and we'll look forward to that meeting then. But can my, um, couldn't we as board members give you the dates that were available because you do have Thanksgiving. If we want to get this meeting on our books, we have to do it early November. So, yeah, there's a three week gap between today and our November 12th meeting. So, what I was trying to do is look for that Monday or Tuesday at the two week mark, which is normally our board meeting, like right. fourth or fifth. I'm trying to get those. Days. The first thing we have to do is pin down Carrie because she's constantly she's presenting to boards. And we couldn't do this without Carrie here. Right. Okay. And Marianne's working on that. And Marianne's going to be working dog on this, right? You're going to dog on this to get this going. Thank you. So, then from there, once we get. Carries three dates. We'll get with John and Tim, and then we'll send them out to the board. I mean, if the if if the board wants, they can send dates. They know they're available. Marianne could try to. It's going to be tough to accommodate everybody, sure. but we can try. Okay, and 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 for my naive to this here, the ten-year life safety survey report. There's a date of August 27th on it. Is that subject to change yes. upon our approval? That was the first draft that we looked at as well, a facility. Well, the thing you got to keep in mind, and she kind of said it, but there is a bit of an art, and that's completely a science on doing it, but to a certain extent, we have to, you know, the rules require, and we have to pay a professional architect to make the judgment. So as much as there's going to be an explanation, it's not like she... If, she, if we couldn't say, all right, change this from an A to a B, we don't want to do it in year one. If she, no, 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 that's not what I'm asking. Yeah. I'm just asking is what, if, if the date, the, the date, the date, the date, the date will all change. Yeah, yeah that's why I'm not. Okay. I, I don't want. I'm not want a judge to make a judgment on A, B, or C. I just yeah. the, all drafts. Okay. Gary, all drafts. Gary, remember when we asked her about this. It doesn't go into effect until the state accepts it, which is three months after a submit, Your Honor. 